Hai tai, men so ore. Welcome to the Okinawan Kimono Dressing Demonstration. My name is Jeannie Yamasato. Our model today is Haley Yamasato Gragas. Our dressers are Audrey Gibo and Jerry Maeda. We begin with our client putting on red socks, which normally should be red tabi socks. A real costume dancer would wear underwear of white pants and white kimono top, but the customer's street clothes will be the underwear today. A white pleated skirt called a kakang is worn next, but unless a person is really tall, we don't use it since it doesn't show in our photos. So next we wear a red kimono top called a dujing. We close the front with the left over the right side after seeing that it is worn evenly. We tie a himo belt to keep the red dujing in place. We then tie a long purple scarf temporarily around the waist. Then Haley wears the beautiful Bingata kimono. We check that the arms are in the sleeves properly. Okinawan sleeves are open like a tube. That's to suit the warm tropical climate of Okinawa. We check the back seam of the kimono that it aligns straight down the back. The red eddy or collar is checked to sit evenly around the neck. Okay, then we pull up the two front panels of the kimono close to the floor length. And we tuck the excess panels under the hemo belt with the purple scarf draped in front. We tied the purple scarf into a vertical half bow and then check everything straight. And another purple scarf is tied around Haley's head. The bingata is worn in classical dances and was used by nobility. The expensive silk is hand dyed in several steps and hand painted with designs found in nature. When everything seems neatly in place, we put on the hanagasa or flower hat. This is the iconic symbol of Okinawa. We even have the hanagasa on the cover of our Chimugukuru cookbook. We secure the hanagasa with the ties going from one ear, passing under the chin to the other ear. Then we tuck the ends along the side of the head. When the hat is on, it sounds will be, seem muffled, and the hat is heavy to balance. So we put the hanagasa on the client when she's in front of the camera. And the hat stays on better if she has a ponytail or bun. We try not to handle the hat too much because it's made of delicate silk fabric with a thin bamboo frame. And for little girls who don't want to use the hat, we use red flowers. Okay, we pose the client with additional accessories such as the Nuchibana or Okinawan Lei Expressing Love and the Yotsudake, our Okinawan bamboo castanets.